Hey there, DP. I'm Lizette. And I'm Nandini. Today on the May 20th installment of DP News, we bring you news on... Community service. Activities in the Greek. Beautify DP. And more. DP, DP News starts now. now. Beautify DP this Saturday from 9 to noon. This is the last Beautify DP for the school year, so make sure to attend if you need spring hours for NHS. Wear clothes so you can garden and bring water. Seniors, next Thursday, May 26th, 8 to 8.55, you can pick up your yearbooks, and Thursday after school from 3 to 4, everyone can pick up their yearbooks. Concerts and more concerts. May brings us lots of gray, but it also brings us the spring concert season here at DP, and we've got a bunch of them for you. On Monday, May 23rd, the DP Orchestra and Concert Band will take the stage at 7 p.m. in the EPAC for a night of symphonic music along with a sprinkle of pop, movie music, and Broadway show music. On the next night, Tuesday, May 24th, the DP Jazz Department will feature all its bands, Intermediate Jazz, Advanced Jazz, and Jazz Combo, with special guests, the DP Jazz Choir, also starting at 7 p.m. in the EPAC. There is no admission, but a suggested $5 donation helps support DP instrumental music. And of course, don't forget tonight, the DP Jazz Choir with special guests, the DP Advanced Jazz Band and Combo, EPAC, 7 p.m., be there. Have some unfinished business with a teacher that didn't give you the grade you wanted? Or just feel like throwing water balloons at your fellow teachers and peers? Then next week on Friday, come to the Greek where you'll get to the chance to throw water balloons at teachers and the leadership class. Due to, due to the cold weather, the event would have been today, but has been postponed for next week. Seniors, today is the last day to turn in community service hours. Remember, you need 60 hours to receive your diploma. Come by the Career Center today before 3.30 to get those hours in. Freshmen, sophomores, and juniors, you still have until June 8th to turn in your hours. At After Prom, there were 12 winners. Four winners won cash prizes, and the other eight received some other amazing prizes. The checks will be delivered to the cash prize winners later today. The Texas Hold'em winners were David Gurley, and the runner-up was Kylie McHugh. Seniors, going to SBCC next Tuesday, May 24th, there is a Pipeline 101 workshop from 9 to noon. That's all for your campus news. Now over to Jeffrey and Dallas with the sports. Hello, I'm Dallas Flannery. And I'm Jeffrey Chow, here with your sports report. Girls Beach Volleyball ended their season yesterday, losing to Santa Monica 0-3 in a hard-fought battle. The teams of Audrey Baldwin and Carissa Burns, Danica Minich and Jose da <sighs> Josie Dottie, and Kat Hogan and Allison Minich made their way to the second round of playoffs, finishing their season as one of the top 16 teams out of 49. Good luck next season, girls. Our softball team dominated Lakeside 12-0 for their first round Division IV CIF game yesterday. Jade Sinskull had two runs single off the shortstop's glove during a three-run first inning. Nova Sinskull smashed a triple to the fence for two RBIs, and Allie Milam crushed a triple to center field, bringing home three more runners during a seven-run second inning. And both Milam and Ari Cruz had three RBIs. Also, Madison Pickett no-hit the Lancers 13-16 for four innings, and was so close to a perfect game, missing only by one walk in the fourth inning. Our girls have been to the semifinals for three straight years, and now let's make it four. For their next game, our girls travel to, on Tuesday to compete against Apple Valley. Baseball absolutely crushed a talented Arcadia team yesterday, 13-2, in the first round of the CIF playoffs. Jonathan Salone had a big day at the plate, going 2-3, and three, with three RBIs and two runs scored. The 3-4 punch of Dustin Demeter and Peter Apple had big days as well, with Dustin going 2-for-3 with two doubles and two RBIs, and Peter going 2-for-3 with a double and two RBIs as well. The lineup was not done yet, as the next two batters in the order, Josh Feldhouse and Colter Nisbet, combined for five RBIs, and Davey Demeter also chipped in with two hits of his own. 
Darby Nahn threw another brilliant game, throwing five innings of two-run ball and striking out four to get the win. Darby has been amazing this season, and he has a record of six wins and zero losses with this win. The guys are now 20-8 and eight and will continue their season away at Villa Park on Tuesday. Also, this Friday in the Greek, we're having musical chairs. So if you're coming out for leadership, make sure you come out to the Greek this Friday. All right, you heard that. That's all for your sports report today. And have a fun and safe weekend, DP. And now over to current events. Bye. Good morning, Chargers. I'm Ann Bailey with the news. The Coalition for Access, Affordability, and Success is a new alternative to the Common App app. It's created by an elite group of colleges and universities, including Yale University and Cornell. And its freshly appointed director, Annie Resnick, is an ex-high school counselor and college admissions officer. The Coalition's mission, as summarized by Education Week, is to reach undeserved students in new ways and help them connect with institutions that will offer them good financial aid packages and a very good chance of graduating. Being a developing alternative, the Coalition is facing questions relative to students' privacy and advertisement to other schools. On another note, the House of Representatives turned into chaos according to CBS News after proposed amendment failed 212 to 213 when it seemed like it was going to pass at 217 to 206. The amendment would have prevented federal contracts with companies that discriminate against LGBT employees. That's all for today, DP. I'm Ann Bailey. Have a great weekend. Now over to Emma with the weather. Hey, it's Emma with the weather. Today it's partly cloudy and the high is 70 and the low is 55 with a four foot swell. Have a fun and safe weekend, DP. Hey there, DP. 